These are favors, um, particularly these ones are favors from the Pacific Northwest tool collectors. And whenever they do their best in the West, uh, you have the chance to actually buy the favors. And so I've, I've been starting to collect them through the years and I'm missing a couple still, but I want to actually make a shelf to display them. These ones over here are extras that are then given to people who do a display and I'm trying to collect those as well. But I want basically a curio shelf so I can set these up and, and show the little collection of interesting, cute little tools. One. Ooh. So let's set it to there. That'll do. Pretty, pretty. Let's see, how's that looking? Pretty, good. Ooh, there it goes. So, let's see. Not bad. A little bit fuzzy here. That's pretty darn decent, I'll take it. So, 17 and a half. And I don't care about it being terribly accurate, so we just use a big fat pencil. There we go. One joint. One, two, three. Two, three. Almost. So that would mean trimming those up, which I'm gonna have to do either way. So let's go 16 and a half. All the way around. So 
let's try that. One, two. Get all the junk out of the corner. Don't breathe, don't move. That's happiness, I'll take it. Three quarters of there. So half of 16 and a half is eight and a quarter. Eight and a quarter, there's the middle, right here. Uh, and I want three shelves. It is there. Now, let's bring the shelf down to that. And that. Does that look balanced? That looks balanced. Just shine my line there. Oops, need to put it on the other side of the line. The other side of the line is the right side. So let's see. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Okay, now we can take this apart. Pull these out. So take it all apart and see what we got inside.
top. This is bottom. Yeah, let's put it together and find out exactly what that is. Now, let's find out the actual width of these. Right there. Almost. So we're good right on the corner. And not good back here. So there. That's what we want. One side nice and tight. There. that in, work that in, and you need a little swishin. That one. Oh, too much. Well, there. And then the last piece. Yeah, now we have the fun part. Here we go. Maybe by enough. Fun part. Put these up in here. There. There we go. So there you have it. I wanted to keep this project kind of simple. This is a very basic design for shelves and you can scale it up or down to any particular size shelf you want. Deeper, taller, thinner, whatever you would like. Uh, it doesn't have to be curios, it could also be a bookshelf. It's the, the exact same joinery, just in different shapes and sizes. So I wanted to kind of show off the base, basic simples. I could have done a lot of other things. I could have done some carving. I could have put in a case frame on it. There's lots of other things you can do to, to spice it up. And I'd love to hear your thoughts. What should I do to spice it up? Um, I 
like reading through those. I learn a lot from the comments down below. So thank you for that. Yeah, I, I think I'm going to have to be, start looking for some of the other uh, favors that I'm missing. The Pacific Northwest Tool Collectors has uh, some very interesting things that are kind of fun. So if you'd like to see that and stick around. Also, if you have any questions, comments, thoughts, ideas, snide remarks, thank you. Ah, throw those down in the comments down below. That does help out the channel. Uh, even if it's something as simple as a comment down below. Thank you. That helps the channel grow. As well as hitting the like, share, subscribe. You know all those things. But really, the algorithm is what allows us to grow, get in front of more people. And thank you. That means a lot. On top of that, there are a whole bunch of names over here. Those are all of the fantastic, wonderful, and benevolent people over on Patreon. Without patrons or members in the channel, we wouldn't exist. We are completely sponsored by you. So thank you for that. If you'd like to find out more about that or help out, you can go to patreon.com backslash woodbyright or click the little join button down here and become a member here on YouTube. We have special perks for both, and that really does help us out. So I think that'll do it for now. And until next time, have a wonderful day. A curio shelf is a place where you put small, pretty things. That's why I made it for my wife.